Hello homebrewers, happy homebrew Wednesday to you all. And it's going to be a fairly short one today, I've just got a few updates on um, some bits and bobs that I picked up from my local homebrew store. So, let's show you what I've got in my magic box of tricks. Oh, the first one we have is a Munton's Premium Gold Smuggler's Special Ale. I have actually tasted this around a friend's dad's house. And it is flipping lovely. This is a two can kit, so there's no need to add any extra sugars. And I really am looking forward to getting this on. I should get this on the brew at the weekend, most definitely. Cool. Next up, then, this is recommended by a user. I sorry, I can't remember your name off by hand, but if it was you, please shout out. Uh, this is the brew firm. Gold, it's a Pilsner, um, and it's uh, supposed to have an authentic Belgian taste. It makes only 12 litres as opposed to the normal 23, so it's almost, I suppose, the equivalent of having a two can kit really because you're using, um, using sort of the same amount of malt extract but you're only using half the amount of water. Um, in order to get the full authentic Belgian taste, I am going to be adding 500 kilograms, 500 grams, 500 kilograms, that would kill me, 500 grams of Belgian candy sugar. Now, apparently this is for use in Belgian style ales for the authentic Belgian taste. Um, it's made by brew pack, so see how we get on. And last but not least, I know I've already reviewed this before, but I want to give this one another go. I'm going to get some nicely brewed up in time before summer. Cooper's Mexican Lager. So I was a bit disappointed with it last time, um, using the lime and the malt extract. I don't know, it didn't quite work out okay. So this time, I'm just using some plain old dextrose. Cha -ching. Yeah, just going to use that, and that should do me fine, hopefully. And then last but not least, very boring, just some green, dark green crown caps. So, not much else to report. Um, I've still got to bottle that Demijohn of Beaverdale wine, um, which I showed you last week. And other than that, I just need to get brewing, need to get these kits on and build up my rolling stock because it's quite depleted at the moment, depressingly enough. Need to get some beer reviews done as well. I've got a fairly clear weekend, so hopefully I should be able to get a few reviews under my belt and get them uploaded soon as well. Um, I spent, mind you, I've got quite a bit of my weekend is going to be spent chopping a firewood if I show you how much I've got. A huge pile. I'll show you that compared to a bag of coal next to my barbecue. Um, it's all quite long blocks, so I'm going to have to uh, pack all that up. Fortunately I have my dad's chainsaw so it shouldn't take too long. Well that's it for me. I'm not going to bore you any longer. I'm um, just going to say peace out, happy brewing, happy drinking and remember it's not brewed to be looked at. <laughs>